Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be going over, well, in my opinion, the fastest way to do military tunnels in Rust. Now, this is going to be a puzzle guide, meaning the key cards, and not really so much as just actually doing it to get the free elite crates down there. However, I will show you the locations of the loot down there, so if you want, you can technically still use this. Uh, also, about 0.5% of my viewers are actually subscribed to me. So if you actually genuinely enjoy the videos or learn something, please consider subscribing. Uh, I'm going to start doing actual like fun Rust challenge videos coming up here. So maybe if you like that stuff, I also have a ton of other tutorials that you could obviously follow. Uh, and subscribing just genuinely really helps me out. It's completely free. And if I do something you don't like, you can always unsubscribe. All right. Thank you. And now let's get into the video. All right. Let's hop right into it. The things you're going to need for this is one red card, one blue card, one green card, a fuse, some sort of weapon to uh, fight the scientists with and other players that might come encounter you, some meds to heal with, obviously, uh, and a hazmat suit. Now, even with the hazmat suit, you might still get some radiation, so just be careful of that. It's just like a launch site. They're going to want some sort of water. Uh, it's not going to be too bad if you do have a hazion, just keep that in mind. Alright, so I'm going to quickly run through and kill all the scientists. This is just to clear a quick path so I can get from the very top up here down to the bottom before the fuse runs out. Now, you'll see later why this is highly recommended, although it's not technically necessary. You just have to do everything really fast, so this is just a lot better of a method, in my opinion. Okay, now that I've cleared them all, I'm gonna go straight in here and over to the right. Now, be careful if you haven't cleared them, usually there's about two to three scientists over here. So just keep that in mind. You're gonna wanna head into the armoring room right here. Careful, sometimes there's a scientist in here. Put your fuse in, flip the switch, and sometimes there's gonna be a box there for you to loot. Now you're gonna wanna run all the way down to the end of the military tunnel section. This isn't all the way to the elite crates at the very bottom. I'll also show you their uh, locations if you wanna know them. You don't actually need a key card for them. As soon as you can, you're gonna wanna head over to the left section here and up and over to the green key card door. Flip the switch. Push in here. Now there are sometimes scientists in here. That one out of spaz, thank god I'm in god mode. Run into this room, turn that switch on, and then now you're going to want to run out and head over to the other key card room. Now there are some more elite crates in this red container here. I'm going to go quickly check them. You don't actually need key cards to loot them. Uh, however, it's recommended you have a hazmat suit because there is some pretty heavy radiation in this section here. run through this container right here and you should if you're following the right path arrive at a blue key card door right here swipe the blue key card now there will be more scientists in these following rooms so just be aware of that flip the switch directly under the red key card swipe it and usually there's two to three scientists in here so All right, that's all of them dead. Looks like this one actually had four in it. And now this little section over here is all the loot. Looks like we got three elite crates this run. Not too bad if you include the other elite crates that we actually got just outside. Uh, and then a ton of military crates as well, which is pretty decent. Now run from over here to the other side of the red key card room. Press the button to open the door, but be careful as there is sometimes scientists camping this area. Like that. Now go to the exit only sign, but also you're gonna wanna continue being careful because there are sometimes scientists there 
Now you will be getting radiation down here, so I'd recommend honestly just getting out of here as fast as you can. I typically like to go into the cave here because people will be camping just up top. So this is a much safer alternative to get out. Not many people know of the cave. <coughs> Make sure to check your corners here. Never know if someone's going to be camping you. And now it looks like I'm good. So I'm just going to get out of here and go back to my base and depot. Not a vet haul. And yeah, that's about it. I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. If you did... Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Uh, if you have any video ideas, I'm running a little bit dry. Or if you want any future tutorials, let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear them. I'm also looking to do some challenge type stuff. So if you got any ideas for stuff like that, hit me up. Join my Discord, you know. And uh, yeah, thank you. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.